in Springfield might have spotted something strange in the sky this afternoon. New Center 7's Brian Bondis discovered the state is about to launch its latest tool in aerial surveillance. All right, are you guys set? It's called Aerostat, a blimp drone mounted with a video camera. It's about the size of a compact car and cheaper to operate than what the state has traditionally used. Um, we're looking at new applications, new ways of stretching the taxpayer dollar, and we think that unmanned aircraft systems provide an alternative in, in some cases where we can deploy small aircraft to uh, do surveying and mapping. Always go slow in the beginning. At $15 an hour to run, the state can see far more uses. I'm down 45 miles per hour. Rob King worked in Afghanistan, training soldiers to look for IEDs. Today, he's working with staff from the Lebanon and Warren Correctional Facilities. Um, this particular system is unique. This is more of a commercial and law enforcement variant, and so it's not as robust as, say, the Army system. King says the Nashville Police Department has an aerostat and use it to help with natural disasters and large events like concerts. You're basically looking at areas of interest. This camera will allow you to identify either a truck or a car or different types of personnel walking out to a couple of miles. The company says the camera can see up to 15 miles and stay in the air for five days. King says those capabilities are a great help to prisons. I think it's going to be a, a game changer for them. I think they just increased their situational awareness, expanded their situational awareness out a couple miles. I talked with someone from the DRC today and they told me they're just assessing possible uses for the aerostat right now and have no date of when it could be flying around Warren County. Reporting from the Springfield Bureau, Brian Bondis, News Center 7.